Today guys, I have for you the VMP best class setup. This gun is so good. If you remember my CUDA best class setup, I said that was a good gun. Well, the VMP, after the nerf of the Vespa, is the best gun in my opinion now. So let's get straight into it. I've got grip, quick draw and stock. I used to run grip, quick draw and long barrel, but I mean, this gun has such a short range that there's not much point putting long barrel in there just for some extra range if you're gonna be at close range anyway. So I've gone for stock. On the submachine guns, stock is so, so useful. It's absolutely amazing. It lets you strafe while aiming down sights at a walking pace, which means one, uh, if I have the ghost perk on, I can keep it because the minimal speed I need to be going at to keep the ghost perk running is walking pace. So if I'm aiming down sights with stock, I can keep ghost, the ghost perk up and stay off the enemy's mini maps, which is really, really useful. And also I can dodge bullets so well and get my aim on even better with it. As you'll see in this crazy gameplay here, so let's get into the attachments. I'm using grip just because I've tried this gun without grip and the recoil goes off to the left, then the right, then the left again and you really can't aim with it. It's just a struggle, such a struggle. So I've got grip in there just to help your aim at those longer ranges when this gun does drop damage ever so slightly. Next up we have quick draw just so I can win those one on one gun fights, those quick battles, especially since I don't have fast hands, I want quick draw. So, I'm, so I can aim my gun down sights faster than the enemy can. Let's get straight into the perks. Perk one, we have Ghost, just because this perk is extremely useful. I mean, I used to run Sixth Sense because I thought that was really good, and it is, still is really, really good. But I run Ghost more often because I, if I play TDM or Domination, I want to stay off the enemy's mini maps. And with awareness, I can hear where people are around corners anyway. So that's why I'm using Ghost. Next up we have Scavenger, just so I can scavenge that ammo and keep on the streak with this gun because I want to keep on the streak with this gun, not pick up some horrible Dredge 48 or Dracon when I don't want to use it. And finally we have Dead Silence and Awareness. Now I always run these, you guys know I always run these. I like Dead Silence because other players using Awareness cannot hear me, so if I'm playing against a really really good player who knows what they're doing, they cannot hear me. They can't hear my footsteps, they can't hear my wall runs which make a huge sound so dead science is really useful there then also it helps with awareness because obviously awareness being my ear radar so i can hear everyone without dead silence which is absolutely insane but also with dead silence and awareness i can't hear my own footsteps so i can run along while listening for enemy footsteps on the move which is really useful when you're using a submachine gun like this because i want to know where people are and be constantly on the move to get closer to my enemies so i hope you guys enjoyed this best class setup it's absolutely crazy if you don't believe me with taking off the long barrel give it a go stock is so 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 important in this game and it's really good now i've got to grips with it you will think to yourself it's bad to begin with because you're not used to strafing that fast your aim will be a bit off but trust me, if you stick with it for a couple of matches, you will get used to it and your aim will get much better. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in my next video.